Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get the Hunt Break In 2 badge in the official Roblox The Hunt event. So, to get this badge, you have to defeat three waves of um, break in characters. So, this takes about 20 minutes, almost exactly 20 minutes. So, basically, yeah, you tip, try to do the gym, all that. I'll be showing you all that stuff. So, basically, from here on out, you have to join a bus. So, uh, me and Chimmy will be doing this one together again. This is the 10th badge of the day. This is, a fi this is officially our fifth. 50th badge okay we are halfway done with this event well technically a little bit more than that if you guys don't care about the other five extra badges but i do so i'll probably end up doing all the badges unless one of them's robux then probably not but yeah basically you have to look for shelter you spawn into the game and then basically the whole thing is you fighting and keeping them out of our base basically is all break into like break into i don't really care for the um story games to be honest i don't know i just don't find them fun i feel like they take too long and if i die at the end i have to redo the whole thing and it just make me mad but yeah basically um you have to like work out all that to fight all them and it just will benefit you a lot more if you do stuff like that so yeah anyways here's the little secret evil villain based stuff basically when you're spawning into the game you have to watch all these things that they're going to talk about so here's like this guy like we're just like hiding out and everything basically is the context and everything we just have to make sure we can defend our base when the people come over to try to defeat us but anyway stuff you can do is work out with weights which will build your strength so you, do you don't have to die also i recommend being a nurse so you can heal your other teammates and because you already get a crowbar anyways um and then also something else you can do instead of just like doing the weights you can also run on a treadmill which also will help um but yeah besides from that that's pretty much all you can do you can also fight people i didn't put that clip in the video because um i didn't feel like it's necessarily necessary but on the other side you can fight um bots that will also build your strength um but yeah um so yeah just keep doing this i mean this is very beneficial to your character it's gonna help you a lot more to defeat them i wouldn't say it's hard i feel like the only thing that's annoying is the end uh and yeah that's pretty much it so uh okay like, we gotta finish this uh we're still all weighing in and we're trying to get all the strength we can that's be pretty much it i mean you basically it's a story game you guys want to play those just play through a story it takes around 20 minutes like i said here's the treadmill scene but yeah after this scene we have officially started our first wave so this will be the introduction to all that we can't skip it because people refuse to do so for some reason but basically a little context is that we were caught or something like on tv and blah 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 all that and then now we just have to like you know fight them i guess i already know how to do with that so basically now from here you have your wave one so basically you just peep you like beat them up with all the crowbars you get and then you can also have snacks which will help you if you do choose to use those but yeah that's wave one it was very quick on um, and then this is wave two so wave two is starting we got a bunch more here uh but yeah i recommend going and getting a better crowbar mine's golden because i ended up spending it for 20 but for 20 you have a chance to get a wrench all that um this like cyan and gold ones probably diamond actually now that i think about it they also drop money so you can get better stuff and food and all that which will help you so i recommend getting those when you can and yeah here we are with the second wave is done and yeah okay uh so from here uh this is where you want to go so if you want to get an extra crowbar which i do recommend because it'll give you more power the cyan one is the epic one so make sure to try to get that one all the other ones are better but you know cyan is really cool the diamond one whatever you want to call it and yeah the diamond one's a good one and this one will help you a lot more so you have a better efficient efficiency with battling them anyways here's the last wave and this is also the where a boss is so this is the last wave that you need to get before we can claim our badge and be halfway done with this and basically from here you just battle the little mini ones then we hit the bigger guy after the other two the, de the detective and then this old guy basically try to fight him stuff and then he'll basically throw them across the room and then they'll be like knocked out and then we have to finish the fight it's pretty simple and straightforward to be honest so yeah okay now that they're all the way back there we can now fight and this is our final one before we can get the badge okay so if you're following along with my channel this whole time we are officially almost done with the event we're like halfway so we're making good progress uh and then tomorrow we'll be able to claim the hood so i'll be make 10 more videos i might make an extra one today but i have to write my essay after this so i'm gonna focus on school after this and if i'm still awake i will do that but most likely this is probably the last video for today besides the short and you'll get the badge once you complete all three waves by the way so that's how you get the break in two official badge for the hunt so i really hope this was helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe and don't forget to post notifications i'll see you guys in the next one